like Craig says, you know, giving back at a young age, I think a lot of people have been inspired by UCLA uh, and NSU program, Nikkei Student Union program. And our next uh, presenter is Kevin Machino. He is the current president of the Nikkei Student Union at UCLA, and um, he is a tremendous upgrade from when Craig Ishii was president. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, but he uh, he has brought along with him um, some other members of NSU and um, doing a Pachaka Chow presentation with one person seemed tough. They're going to do it with five people. So we're going to see how this how this works out. Um, but let me first start off by introducing each and every one of them. Uh, Kevin Machino uh, is a Japanese American. Um, he's uh, goes to UCLA. He's a fourth year biochemistry major pursuing a career in medicine. He is second generation, uh, born and raised in the greater Los Angeles area. Uh, Co-presenting with him tonight uh, are Albert Quach, a, a third year psychology major, and he is the internal vice president of the Nikkei Student Union. Ile Rosas is a fourth year Japanese and global studies major, and she is the external vice president of NSU. Hiromi Aoyama is the third year is a third year communication studies major and she is the treasurer of Nikkei Student Union. And last but not least is Ashley Hanma, a fourth year Japanese major, and she is the secretary of Nikkei Student Union. Um, they are a fantastic group of people and uh, they traveled a long way to get here today. So um, please uh, join me in welcoming them up to the stage. Uh, thank you, NSU from UCLA. <laughs> Japanese American Interest Student Organization at UCLA. And a lot of what we have done in the past and what we continue to do is uh, reflected in our mission statement here. And like Craig said, we strive to be inspired and give back to the community. And we aim to sustain like a circle of community that we've come to form over the years. All right, so here's a video of our last year's uh, members. I like how there's like so many people in the NSU and the every event you go, you can meet like new people, kind of. Oh, and it's fun. A lot of fun. It's fun because I get to meet like different people. So from the video, you can see that uh, different people come to NSU for various reasons. Um, of course, friends. Um, you can see uh, families that we form within our uh, club, uh, club uh, committees on staff, and of course, culture. But one thing that brings all these people together is community, especially the JA community and Little Tokyo. So for all the reasons that people join NSU, the Japanese American community has provided a welcoming space for these individuals, whether it be through supporting through cultural events, providing an outlet for sports, or recognizing leadership within the community. Thus, for all the community does for us, we want to show our appreciation for it in the best way we can. That the JA community has given a lot to NSU, and really, we really want to give back a number of different ways. So a J, the J community is a part of NSU, and NSU is a part of the J community. And one way that we stay involved in the greater J community is through the Intercollegiate Nikkei Council, um, which is made up of the Nikkei organizations in Southern California schools. I see volunteers in JA events such as K Fun Run, put on by JCCC, and as panelists in the College Day Info Session, put on by the Venice Culver Chapter JACL. Yeah, and along with outside, like with INC, uh, NEC also tries to keep the JA community uh, awareness and within the UCLA community alive. Um, every year we try to support our uh, Asian American department by going to their events, and we also went to like, help out with TAG project, as you can see. And um, yeah, we just go to have some various screenings uh, during our general meetings to inform our general members more. Held annually every spring quarter, the UG Kyoko Memorial Basketball Tournament was created in memory of one of the founders of the Asian American Studies uh, Center at UCLA. Each year, various Nikkei clubs and players from all over Southern California, many of whom were involved in JA leagues, come to uh, for a weekend of fun and games at Poly Pavilion. And you see graduation, <laughs> in addition to um, NSU's passion for recognizing achievements of JA within the community. Um, NSU helped coordinate the Nisei graduation ceremony for um, Nisei who were forced to leave UCLA for internment camps at the beginning of World War II. And as youth of the generation, it was really um, an honor for us to take part in this part of the history. Okay. 
Thank you. So to help come, uh, continue promoting uh, Japanese American culture on campus, we hold um, our fall festival called Obon on the Hill, where we educate UCLA students about Japanese American history with um, cultural performances, trivia, culture, uh, and um, an expression of our Japanese American cultural environment. Um, uh, involvement in UCLA is there are performance groups. We have our traditional Japanese or Odori dance group that performs at our annual culture night and in community events such as Cherry Blossom Festivals and Nisei Week. And so Kyoto Taiko is another group. Uh, it's a traditional Japanese drumming group that like Craig said he was in. And this is a video, of a clip from our CN and them performing from it. <laughs> In addition, our last performance group is our modern team, and it's our hip-hop team that participates in various competitions around Southern California, in addition to events such as Chinese Night. Thank you. In addition to all three performance groups, we have a drama group during our culture night that we hold annually. And uh, what they do is we, ha we, we tell a story based on like past uh, J historical events. And the significance of this is we want to keep the history alive and in, the, in our UCLA community and commemorate the Executive Order 9066. NSU has been making the Manzanar pilgrimage every spring to commemorate those who were interned during World War II. During this uh, stay, in addition to the visit to the museum, we attend the ceremony, have an opportunity to hear experiences of actual internees, and do an open discussion with the attendants of the ceremony. Yeah, along with uh, going to various places to support the J community, we also go in the summer to Obones. You know, we encourage our, or encourage our general members to go out to as many Obones as possible around the LA community. And um, we also go helped out Nisei Week. You set up the Agura during the uh, closing ceremony. And Adori also performed during the opening ceremony. And as Craig has said, uh, we have a Chibi K internship. Chibi K is a kids' fun run held every year in Little Tokyo uh, on Children's Day Festival. For the past four years, NSU have been co-programming this event with the JCCC uh, as an internship program as interns cultivate their leadership skills as they plan and organize this fun event. One of our greatest goals to give back to the community is to actively help sustain Little Tokyo and Japanese American causes through our volunteer works. Um, we participate annually in the Little Tokyo Health Fair and have attended special community events such as the Little Tokyo Rally and the Survey Project. Um, we also had a program called Project Hashi in which students volunteered weekly at different organizations such as the Little Tokyo Service Center, JCC, and JANM. And of course, we always have fun in Little Tokyo and other J community as we've gone to different exhibitions such as this one, uh, sh uh, sorry. <laughs> the Mike Shinoda exhibition, and we've also gone to plays such as the No-No Boy. Yes. Um, so what now? Um, we're trying to start a volunteer program in Little Tokyo that targets teenagers, and we hope to inspire them. They're from low-income housing, and we hope to inspire them to um, be motivated to go to college and hopefully be involved in the community like we all are today and care about it. So extending that cycle of community, all of us here are part of a community, and we, should, we feel like we should put forth the effort to make the community a part of us. So that's it. Thank you.